Hey folks, welcome back to Ostrov, where we've had a couple of baby sheep. Yep, these guys are... Oh, newborns, right there. A ram and a sheep. Mm-hmm. Man. Alright, so this is the one that took the longest to plant, and it's definitely looking the weakest. This one came out pretty good, though. And good crop of sunflowers coming in. Otherwise, what else do we have? We've got this guy freshly uh, planted. And a couple of years, that'll be ready to go. How's fish going on? We are fishing. Boats are pretty good. Swinging over here. Same thing. It's all coming in. I decided to up these guys and just give them another run. Put some red X's out there to kind of defeat the uh, the whole thing of them not being willing to go and work on the next uh, the next building project that has six trees left instead of these guys all the way over here coming to do it. But yeah, we'll put the red X's out there and we'll let them get working on. I did set a warehouse over here to work on and a warehouse over here. I'd like to get these guys built so that I can see them. So I'll make those some of the next projects though let's see we have two fishing docks which aren't truly necessary we have this one it'd be nice to see that happen so over here this fishing dock we have brought all the materials except for the thatch okay let's move this fishing dock back so we'll go from here to there and get that that road in get the uh, the cobblestone in over there and just see what that looks like and the two warehouses and the patron of the arts museum so let's look at that one more time i was told it is an art museum this doesn't really tell me much uh click on you where are you right there no nothing to read so it's not i don't think it's an art museum it's it's a monument and it was actually uh, purchased as a dlc for the game to to support the folks over there during the war. But that's gonna go on over there. Thatch is over here, we're waiting for thatch and we've got plenty of it, okay. All right, we are in the middle of May. Um, I don't think there's anything special that happens in May. I did go through and kind of clean these up a little bit and reset the corner a little better so that it wrapped the road just right and added one over to this side we need to add one more over here thought i'd wait and do this one on camera just give me something to do while i'm while i'm waiting let's see oh i did put one in there okay never mind i didn't realize i had done that okay so we are we are we have houses wrapping the end of this this uh little subdivision over here uh, when we're going to get to those I don't know there's not a lot of extra jobs over in this area there will be more and more as we go but as we move like the brickworks over here I do want to get the soapworks going again soon I just got to figure out where to put it because we've got a lot of tallow building up 1,000 tallow there there's 750 over here still have lots of storage space though so we're okay but eventually it does need to get moved over here and it's a good sized building so I'd like to see at least this building get built so I can figure out where it goes I assume it's in here somewhere along with the asheries to run it so we can grab bark out of here which I haven't turned on we could set that for 2000 just to get some being produced two guys and they're both waiting for a partner to help them get a log okay but I don't know what other trees to take out in this area I could do all of these that are spawning the new trees that are spawning in the pathway what happens if you put an X on something like that it just goes away ah that's nice okay because we have quite a few of them that are starting to plug up the path here you could go away and spin around like so that looks like a clear shot in there although I'd say you could leave and I think we're okay there now. Now, I had another path in here, didn't I? Just this one. Okay. What was I thinking of? There was a path I was kind of roaming around 
while or in between episodes that had a lot of trees plugging it up. Where was I? Mm. Well, I haven't actually looked down this path in a long time. Yeah, we do have a path through the woods, but it's kind of unofficial. It's just kind of roaming all around in there. Um, up in here, you could go away. I, I could set all these. I don't know that they're going to actually do anything. But they may roam the map and deal with all these things. We're setting it with the the one over there, though, because I have a, I'm assuming that the one over here, the forestry over here, is going to just be working building sites. So, sure, we'll... We'll try this out. You are actually sitting where? You're on the fence line, but eh, we'll do that. Who is that? That is Balaklia. We'll take you out. And... Now, we've done this before when we first started the game and never got any of these trees taken down. They just ignored them for a dozen episodes till I gave up and started using park benches. Yeah. So, we'll leave the rest. Don't know which of those trees, which of those pathways are official or they're they're going to cease to exist once we place other buildings in the area. Anyway, but yeah, we do get trees that, that just kind of spawn into what used to be a forest area and just kind of try to fill the forest back in again naturally. Um, what now? I guess I needed to have sped that up because not much time has gone by. Okay, so we're working on this one. And that's just a matter of these guys actually showing up to work. Yeah. From the majority of the town, so from up in there, hit their their uh, town hall, and then they come to work. So this is probably their path over here, right out of the woods. Yep. Then I don't think we will employ this one yet. Don't think that's going to happen until we start seeing housing up along this ridge. And that's really going to look interesting. I mean, looking at it from right here, it's just a, a nice ridge where there's going to be just a, a whole neighborhood up here someday. Yeah, kind of interesting. So we've got the two small granaries over here. Thought about a school somewhere. Exactly where, I am not sure. I thought about it in here, but... Then I got to thinking, may or may not be the best place, but let's look at it again. Education, is that you? That's government buildings. Here, primary school. So if you were to sit along this road, uneven terrain. Okay, so you're not going to go in here even if I wanted to. You're going to have to turn this way to do it, and that doesn't even work. There's one spot right there, and that cuts right across the road. So it's not going to go right there. All right, so you are done, and you can just sit there. So they're moving over to this area. That should go pretty quick. Um, only 88 stone? Interesting. And it's on its way. So that really should go fast. Then we're going to pop into these guys just to get them in there and Start moving supplies over to this part of the island. Get this gazebo in. And then what? Small granaries? Really, we're just waiting to see this clear out. Four trees left. And these guys finally got hired up enough to be able to do it. So they're hauling all that away. What they're going to do afterward, I don't know. We'll see if they head out after chasing red X's or not. Or if they just sit around twiddling their thumbs, making... You know, making firewood that they don't need anymore. Mm-hmm. Though, we definitely have a place to uh, to use that firewood over here. We had a trader, didn't we? Yeah, Balaklia. So you were over here, and how much time is left? We've got 14 days left. Balaklia. Let's take you back down. Potatoes. We do have some in town. How old are they right now? Are you up in here? No, and you're not in there. Though I wonder if I should pull them into here just so from the two farms I can find them and not have to keep chasing them around. Let's do that. Let's put uh, potatoes uh, probably no more than 2,500 at a time. So we can pull those into here. I'm guessing they're sitting over here. 
Yeah, and they're about half rotted already. So let's get rid of about maybe 700 of those. Yeah. So you, let's pull in potatoes right there. 700 and temporary. There's still six shoes over here. You guys take shoes, potatoes, 700 deal. Uh, you do not do shoes. You do dried fish, 1,200. Um, and we're in the season now, so we could get rid of probably the same number, 14 or 700. We'll do that, 700 there. And dried fish, 700 here. Okay, what else you got? What else do you need? Sunflower oil. So we've got almost 1,200, and they're willing to buy almost that amount. Hate to take us down that low, but that is a convenient number there. Clear it all out and bring new stuff in. Let's do that. 11.58. And right there, sunflower oil. 11.58. There we go. What else? Silo. Clothes, where are we in clothes now? We're at none. Okay, gotta go check that out. Textile, leather, metal parts, everything here is fine. Honey, we're at a thousand. Do we need to buy anything? I don't believe we do. What do we have in town? 10,000 in town. Stone. Okay, so we're fine there. We just sell a few things and be done with that. Alright, so speed things back up. Looking at the pavement, which is actually just about done. A little more right there. There it is. Okay, so you're in. Going to start working on a couple of warehouses. Let's... Yeah, we'll leave it alone. Let's see if we can get both those warehouses done. In other words, while they're over there, just leave them over there. So we could be putting in that well over here now. Yeah, let's do that. You, water, this one. And you can kind of touch. But do I want to? It, it seems so small now. <laughs> uh, what was that? Marefa is visiting. So let's... If we do that, put benches on both sides. Hmm. Really debating this one now. Give me this fence line. You went to there? You're actually clear over here. Interesting. And I can't tuck in any deeper because of the, uh, the colors there. And that's the wrong angle. So you're clear over here to continue... Whoops continue the same angle as the road so you're shooting for right there which means you hit right here okay well that will grow the grass back in and in that case you might even want to come down then hit a well or they're just going to cross over and move in like this up to this doorway hmm okay well well, then, something like that. Where exactly? Let's say center from that space to here. So somewhere right in there. You're there, and we'll get you built before I set benches and other things around. I want to actually see it. So move you in also into something like that. Okay, speed you guys up and get all those materials brought over. So we are working on... Oh, Marifa. Marifa, we only bought warm clothes from you, right? I don't remember there being a lot of commerce with Marifa. Right here, um, 17 days left. You want to buy from us. Flour. Okay, let's do 1,000 flour. Uh, right 
there. Warehouse complete. 1,000. And do that. Other thing coming in. 700 potatoes, 700 fish. 1058. 100 left to go. Yep, everything's making it in. Okay. Uh, Marifa, flour, sunflower oil, buckwheat, chicken eggs, horseshoes, metal parts. Nothing there. Buy from you. We had been buying wheat. We could buy hemp just to get hemp in there. We're making our own. We're not selling clothes anymore. Yet we're using it as fast as we can find the hemp or flax to make the textiles with. So we're at 5,500. Let's do. I saw wheat right there. There's about 1,000 in there, 1,100. Let's do 1,000 wheat and all of the hemp. Honey, textile, broadcloth. All right, that's good enough. Okay, you guys coming in? We just saw a warehouse go in. You are this one. So, I like that. This, these kind of landed randomly. I might pull these out and straighten this up a little bit or take them out completely and build another building right here. So, you are going to be firewood in and you're going to be charcoal out. I think that's the plan there. 10,000. Okay, so charcoal and firewood. So you guys could... Let's turn you off. Um, let's move these commands over. Apply to all. And by cart, apply to all. Okay. So you are bricks at the moment. You could be more bricks. Just to put something in there. You are lime. You are bricks. Until we move something over into this one. So that one actually could be the bricks and other kind of building materials, but let's do that. You are, come on, click. You're off as well. You're going to be bricks, 10,000 of them, and that'll get things moving over into this, this island, this part of the area. I call it an island, even though it is just a you know a jetty of land. I guess it'd be a peninsula, but to me, this... This is overwhelming. This is this is an island to me. An island with a land attachment. There we go. Okay, now, guys, don't all leave at the same time. we got seven of you to choose from. Someone needs to be working right now. Come on. So, what is this? We're waiting to find enough workers. Okay, pause. And right here, ladies looking for a job. There's three. Okay, so we know they're out there somewhere. And over here, we've hired everyone. So you've got at least one worker. You've got two. And just waiting on you. You've got your one. Uh, warehouse is done. Let's put in here bricks. 10,000. And let's move these orders over. Okay. So we'll have somebody working there soon too, which is probably going to be our, uh, yeah, our orchard worker. Um, okay, slow it down so there's still time to figure it out. These two booths here, we've set to leave their job in in uh, July. There's only one person working here. Other ladies would be these ladies. And they really don't need to be there in July. So let's think about that. We're not doing seasonal hiring. So if we do, then turn them all back on. Turn them off in July. Let's apply to all. You didn't go away. What am I missing here? Small granary. Seasonal hiring. Ah, off season. There we go. So that turns them off on all of them in July. That right there is immediately six ladies available to grab these other jobs for that one month. So that works. Okay. So that should take care of the orchards. That that step alone. All right. So you are no longer overloaded. And we're actually starting to haul. You have got 200 bricks. That's all you can haul on a cart. You're construction. You're not a carter. So I wonder if the carters can haul more. You are construction also. Okay. So in that case, we could move, say, how many over here? Let's move 5,000. 
Uh, 6,000. Two. This one. Right there. So you're going to be hired. There's 6,000 on its way. You're going to go off and get the other 5,000 or whatever it turns out to be as they start stealing from the 6,000 to fill this up. All right, so we are actually... We're not. Those construction guys were hauling bricks. Where are they hauling them to? You take bricks, don't you? Yeah. So there's a, you know, a thousand or so bricks going on right there. Okay. So they're filling up this one. And the well's being built as well. Good. Get that one done. Speed things back up again. So middle of July. And we are definitely taking fruit. Right there, waiting for it to arrive. Uh, fruit, yeah, cherries and apricots. And you are still waiting for somebody. And why is there two? Oh, okay. So, those two don't need two, the other ones do. That's what happened. Okay. But, if it happens, it happens. If it doesn't, it doesn't. We don't get a lot of benefit from those anyway. It's a job. It's an income. All right, so you are being loaded up. You, I heard a noise, so you have been built. All right, so you're right there. Let's, let's have the benches facing. Let's go with the, you're the fancier one. Uh, F, yeah, you're the fancier one. Let's have you guys facing in. And let's do something a little different. Um, about like there. There. And what just happened? The monument got built, and we're doing benches. Okay. You're there. And then I want to think about this. Trying to kill their ability to walk through it. Is that possible? And is that 45 degrees? Yeah, calm down, people. Who is that one? Let's slow it down. R. Corners to corners. A little further. About like that. And shift. And then can I F around to there and have it be right? Not quite. Something like that. Okay. So bushes all around that. I think we got something going on there. All right. So here's this one. I've never built this one before. So he's just a monument. And quite a statement piece. And there's stone underneath. I didn't realize that. Okay. I know recently there was an update that did some work on the stonework so that it would flow around things better, around benches and that sort of thing. Dare I try to get stone into here? Hmm. What else happened recently? So it was Bench Bench and Subravinkovay and the Patron of the Arts Monument. Bench, Bench, Bench. Okay. So they're already using them. Let's see if I could do something like this. I don't know that I can. Now, I can't even see where I'm supposed to go or not supposed to go. Well, I could try... I could try to there. I don't know if it's going to let me. Can I do it in the... green zone? Not quite. Now, can I... I can't just shoot through and have it autofill or anything like that. No. Okay. Yeah, that's, that's just not going to be easy to do. Alright. So, that is there. We'll come back to that one later. What are we doing right now? We're over here. We are back to working on the row house. 
which still isn't ready by a long shot. So let's move small granary in place. What are you, brickworks? Ooh, you're next. Get to work on that one. And what are you? That is the other fishing dock. All of these need trees. You don't. You're clear over there, though. Hmm. I don't think I want to deal with that one right now. So I guess you guys are next. So brickworks. And then maybe by then the carters will have continued to move, move uh, bricks around. We're still needing 7,500. And slowly but surely we're moving 6,000 over here. We're going to be quite a while before we can get this guy built and maybe another episode or two looking that way so a row house we're going to move back over we'll get both the granaries built and we'll get taking trees down right there so you are five trees left what are you fishing dock you're this one you're 11 trees left and you are that one 10 trees left okay so fishing dock is probably right there so we'll work on all these next Okay, speed you back up. And there was a trader to think about. I want to say they bought our salt. Ah, uh, you're here, aren't you? Yeah. And 13 days left. You buy potatoes and flour. So, flour is probably a no. Potatoes are definitely a no. And that is it. So buying from you lime iron iron ore glaze wool sheep skins we are going to need some we're nowhere close to slaughtering our own and we're making our own broadcloth so we're going to come out of balance with sheep skins soon so we'll get 500 of you coming in still 5600 over there uh marifa still has something coming in but it's basically done so we're still looking good there. Okay. Um, speaking of funds, how is our tavern doing? Holding a 20. Okay, so we've hit a good balance with you guys. And our family over here that was having trouble, we're holding a 20. Okay. So I think we've got a decent tax set up now. And what happened to you? <laughs> you ran out of nutrients. That's odd, because normally it wouldn't let you even plant it if there wasn't enough nutrients. It would give you an exclamation point. So how did this happen? I don't know, but we are... Um, yeah, growth only went to there and it quit. Wow. So we are harvesting right now. So how are we over here? Got five people. Though there was a time when we filled that whole thing there. But we're now directly competing, so that's probably it. Okay, alignment-wise, this is one that was kind of funny as far as how the rows ended up. This is not bad. That stagger, that, that diagonal, it's pretty good. This looks good. A little off right there, but that's fine, and this looks okay. So you guys are mowing through this, but you're each taking your own row. That's why it looks funny. Yeah, so they're just kind of interesting. Okay, so over here, nobody is available to work on logs. We have seven logs, so the one that is here can work on firewood. Bark on wood, probably. Yeah, for the uh, different construction projects over here. So you are getting your bricks, and there's 1,000 1, of 10,000 in there. You are loading up with firewood, which means I could empty out one of these other ones. This one probably does not need the firewood in it. Just 10 there, and then 10 charcoal coming out. You need to be empty. Where's the charcoal? You already are. So we could make you empty. Let's do that. Make you empty. And, oops. Um, Dirkachi, lime is over here. So where do we put lime? Lime could be right there. So let's do that. You are going to be lime and bricks over here. 
firewood and charcoal over there and these go away and there's a new industry building right here okay so just kind of cleaning things up you're gonna be lime you are right there it's gonna be 10,000 of you and we could put something like thatch out here but I don't know that let's go ahead and make you empty Okay, so you're going to empty into here. I think that's the plan. And we're also going to be doing this. Yeah. Well, they weren't taken from here anyway. They're taken from here and here as fast as they can. Our one guy is just going to be making firewood. That's right there. If he ever comes to work. <laughs> okay, otherwise we're making charcoal. And we're filling up charcoal. 1,200 there. You are leaving? Probably are. With all these laborers available, they're probably going to work through and clean that all up. You never did find anybody. Interesting. So let's turn you back on again for, for the one month. How did you do? Trees look empty. This one never even started. I don't see any apples over here, so I assume you're done. Anybody get over here? I don't see anything with apples on them, so I guess that job got finished too. But this one never even employed. Interesting. Let's put two of them in. Apparently we can do it in July and August. We'll see what happens when it rolls into September. No workers to harvest the fruit. We know we have ladies available because they're busy working all the other jobs too. So you'd think that as they finish a row and go home that somebody would be willing to pop over here. There we go. We're in September. One person jumped in. It doesn't say it's not the right month. No warnings. So she's in there and we should see one of these trees. There it is. Suddenly strip out and go empty. Okay. All right. Well... That was odd, but I'll turn that one off, and I'll have to manually turn that off once she's finished, or it'll she'll stay there all year long. It'll kind of defeat the uh, uh, the seasonal hiring. Just wondering when to turn these houses on. They're all back over here. So we're working on the brickworks. We have brought all the materials over, and just started taking a rest. These guys are putting their carts away, which means they'll be taking a rest, too. So, how are we doing otherwise? You're done. Working on you. September is in full bloom there. We're here and there. Oh, we're almost done with this one. So, we're actually doing pretty well over here. Interesting. You have this one finished? You probably do. Which means we're just doing this now. So who's on their way? Yeah, just one over there. So another round will hopefully fill in these, these voids soon. These guys are almost done. But it looks like they're both going to finish at about the same time. This one a little bit delayed, but... Otherwise a lot better than I thought. Usually we're into, well into October and we're still thinking about it. All right, swinging through the town here. One guy, firewood is still fine. Your firewood's going away. Yours is filling, but it's also being used. Charcoal should be filling from here. And it's just you. So we're waiting for a worker. And you are set women only. How are we doing in that regard? At some point, we're going to no longer have enough left. Right now, there are not enough. Okay. So in that case, I'd say let's go ahead and put a couple of these in place. So you are that one, that one, that one. So you can swing over. And you can swing over. And then you are the third one. Okay, so we'll do the two, or we'll do the three. Let's do the three. All right, and you are, yeah, a lot of traders this episode. So you're over here. What do we get from you typically? Right 
there. Sell. No, buy salt, iron ore, honey, mead. Mead we were fine last time. And that's right, there was... You're done, aren't you? You're done. Forgot to buy the, uh, the booze from you. You only have mead. Okay, so you guys want to buy... We're good on sunflower oil again. We did replace all of that. Flour, we're fine. Clothes, warm clothes, broadcloth, sallow, onions. Down to our last 58 onions. Apples, we could sell. We could sell... Oh, like... 1,600 of those. Good. Deal. And you, 1,600 apples. Right there. Okay. And that's done. I think once I got to apples, I was finished. Yeah, there's no salt in this list. Okay. And how are we doing in salt? I haven't really looked at that in a long time. Down there, 8,700. So we're actually doing pretty good on salt now. Time to start selling it again. Okay, back to speeding up. Let's get this guy built. So our road comes in. Where are these buildings? Right there. So that is that side of the road. The road's right here. Shooting through. This building is going to be on the road, which means these trees need to go away. So there's another reason to play with some red X's. This road in here. You. Like so. There's the fence. So, just like that. Painted through. Okay, you're there. Okay. And we'll stop there. Don't know what happens after that point. Alright, so... Near the end of September, about to get all of our construction guys back. But they're still employed over here. They're still harvesting. How are we over here? This has taken a lot longer than normal. Normally this, this farm is done long before that one is, and we're about even. Interesting. The population is shifting around. Three people working here and only two farm workers. We've got four farm workers and three people over here. Okay. So, that is fine. How are you guys doing? We're at 19 sheep now, out of 30. So, I guess we do need to start thinking about this soon. Probably next year we're going to need to start uh, slaughtering some sheep. And do I want to not be surprised? Three guys in here running cows, even though... We rarely run more than two batches at a time, but we were surprised once and we lost a whole batch. So I think we'll stick with the three. You're in there all the time and you will be doing the sheep when that finally happens. Okay. Um, boats coming and going. Yeah, well, we got at least another year there. Uh, 7,000 hay over there and 6,000 over here. Still taking these guys down otherwise we are now into October so that means that that now there's more laborers than ever what on earth <laughs> well it could be that they're they hired in September and haven't finished their their round yet before they went back to a, their original jobs so three guys over here and you're basically done two guys left you're leaving you're going to finish, hopefully, all of it. See if you can handle two rows there. And then you'll be done, and then just be the farm workers gathering the last of what's left in here. Now, this was buckwheat. Interesting. Very few sheaths, so they're, they're bringing those in quickly. Hmm. Okay, Brickworks is going in, then we'll transfer goods from the other one and then shut it down and delete it and set some hay dryers up in that area. So, are you empty? 
you're not, and you haven't even started. Did I say make empty? I did not. Really make empty. You're going into here, lime, and we're still getting rid of some of the firewood, which goes into here, and there's plenty of room for it. Okay. And you, when you're working, you'll be moving it all out. I wonder if there isn't enough of these guys now. And we have some of the neighbor repairs. Interesting. Maybe it is time to get a second carpentry guy in here. Not enough metal parts for repairs. Really? Interesting. Metal parts is set at 100. And set at 100. So we've been stockpiling them back over here. Um... We have not. We did long ago. You don't have any metal parts either. What is going on with the metal parts? We've been building a lot of carts. And maybe repairing plows. Okay. So we're just going to take our time, apparently. And metal parts are there. You've got iron and you've got charcoal. Uh, 490 iron. 326 iron. Metal parts charcoal is a little limited but we've got it over here somewhere right yeah I'm sure we do somewhere okay uh, we had charcoal sitting in here that was the brickworks forestry uh, here we still have 4,000 sitting up here in town in this area okay so do we have iron yet we still have 300 iron okay so over here you are ready to tear down no you are ready to load up. So Lime now moves into there. Okay. Childborn, your brick works. Let's start you off with... We had that many workers? I thought it was five like the salt works. Really? Okay. Let's make you empty. And we'll tear you down. Don't know what to do with this warehouse. We had built it to eventually be full of bricks I was about to suggest maybe I want to have two brickworks working but look how much trouble it was to get the bricks out of here all this time it's just so far away from where we're actually going to be using them I don't think it does us any good to make bricks over here it's a lot of traveling okay so that's going away and a lot of those goods are probably going to get shoved maybe into this brickworks four people over here Batches of a thousand. Let's get three batches going. And start the process. And you're going to be stored right there. Okay. Bunch more on their way. Though we still need to be loading this area up. Still only 2,400 bricks over here. So houses are going in. Which means the construction workers are not doing it. But the carters could be doing it. So I wonder if it's time to get more. Uh, get another cart shed over here. Probably is, though. It's going to be a while before we can make those carts. Yeah. Cart shed looks like this. Good sized building. He's not going to go along the front like that. So. It makes sense, though, that he's probably near here, just like that one's right there. So they can get to wherever they need to be, right, right across the bridge. Yeah, I think so. I don't see us doing anything with the shoreline. So you could be something like that. Probably a road that eventually works its way through. Comparable to this road here. So I think that means you're there. Aligned how? I don't think you line up with the bridge. Now let's curve you in a little bit. I think the bridge is going to be more like a V road wise and something like that get you up out of the mud we'll go with there so you go in and and you're probably in here before these houses well it's hard to see that before the houses that still need to have their trees taken down speaking of no don't do that you're over here and three trees left so i assume that these guys are doing that work Right there, chopping a tree. Yep, you're on your way. Let's see what these guys are doing. We are not doing because we can't get enough guys to come over here and work. Okay. So, I guess that answers my questions. 
you and all move in and get this neighborhood built as well these are bigger lots so we're going to start seeing a lot more food moving in and speaking of everything has been sold off and good size load of, of goods here though you never seem to find anything and it's just it's random what happens to grow here i mean we, we take p pumpkins on this one but apparently nobody over here is growing pumpkins yeah pumpkins are you a thing pumpkins are there no pumpkins in this list are you a thing over here we used to buy pumpkins from folks we don't anymore pumpkins where are you you're not even in this one interesting all right what is it likely that we're never going to buy maybe we move the buckwheat out maybe we do that and we fire off pumpkins in there and see if they're around we're storing 10,000 in each of the chicken coops, or 1,000, and they seem to be maintaining pretty good. Otherwise, the buckwheat is sitting in this one, right? Yeah, 5,000 of it when it's available. Okay, let's move the pumpkins in here and let's see if she ever bought any, right? There, nothing yet. You are working. So you're available. There would be a pop-up if somebody, if one of these households had pumpkin to sell. So we just don't make enough pumpkin anymore to have enough to sell. Interesting. And we just don't have enough guys to hire this out. Huh. So what are they doing instead? We've got four guys doing the rock, the stone, and I feel like I don't need that many. Let's... You are finishing up. Let's let you come in, then I'll fire you. And we'll just have three guys over here. We have plenty of stone, and we're not doing lime anymore. And we keep it fully employed. We're just going to be out of stone that much sooner. So I'll let you get into there, drop off your goods, and you are out of here. So hopefully you pick up a job over here, and boom, they're all there. So, why do they do that? I don't know. You. One person left. And so no laborers are being called anymore. Dirkachi is the one that buys our charcoal, right? I have 12,000 charcoal in place. Dirkachi, right there. Yeah, charcoal, you'll take 10,000. We'll sell it all. Deal. Okay, um, buying from you, let's get 500 iron, deal, and what was that last one? Have married and moved into a house, good. So, buying from you, leather, I don't know where we are in leather, let's just do 500 and deal. We're still sitting over 5,000 in the treasury. Flour, dried fish, everything else here looks fine. Selling shoes, lots. So 29, let's bring 2,500 over. Deal, that one. Shoes, 2,500. Gotcha. And world map. Buckwheat, charcoal, and chicken eggs, sunflower oil. We'll not mess with that right now. Close, or we're, we're, we're barely ahead again. Okay, so that hemp came in. Maybe it's gotten shifted out. Yeah, a bunch of it did. And they're starting to make uh, textile again. Honey, we're actually sitting pretty good right there. Let's sell off oh, 600 of it. And deal. Move 600 honey into here. H. Where are you? There you are. And temporary that one. And I feel like we're done. Sallow, we could do that. 400. So a lot of activity coming out of Dracachi right now. Otherwise, selling. Hrilka, there we go. Let's do the whole 12. Oh, that's to sell. Cancel. I want to buy it. Okay, so that's that's not a thing. So let's sell 
that last little bit of charcoal. We can sell that much and we have plenty, so deal. Okay, so you're done. Snow is starting to fall. Good still out in the field. Cleaned up. Cleaned up. Got it all brought in. How are we over here? Got everything brought in. And just working on threshing. Okay. Uh, where am I at? 50-ish minutes. Okay. Um, click on you to see all of our red X's that are still out there. Okay. So you guys are doing what right now then? Going to work. Waiting for a partner. And you're going to go where? A red X? Or are you going to surprise me and go off and work on a building site? Which makes no sense. So, still waiting. Did none of these guys show up? There's somebody. Alright, sawing logs for wood. Didn't happen. Okay, chopping a tree. There you go. And you are going where? I got you right. You're chopping a tree. And you're going all the way over to a building site. Dudes, unless you're going after a red X. Did I do these X's first? <laughs> yeah, they might surprise me. They just might. You going after that one right there? I guess the red X went away. But yeah, they're, they're cleaning up their red X's now. And they've got no logs in storage, so it'd be nice if one of the getting a wooden log to forestry getting a wooden log it's different from a metal log right yeah taking a rest oh so you're going after the other half of that tree I see okay otherwise they'll be chopping more firewood so you are moving lime in now so that's the bricks are almost gone lime is leaving firewood is going in charcoal's going in Bricks are almost full over here. Okay. Working on the houses. And then we're going to be working on... In fact, it wouldn't hurt to get... Where did that ever land? Right over there. Fulling mill. No, where is the cart shed? There you are. Let's put you in at a place like that. So we're getting materials built over here. And maybe we can get some of these guys employed. Otherwise, did these carts get repaired? Three of them are down now. We're in trouble. Yeah. You, not enough metal parts. Let's get another uh, smithy. Another uh, blacksmith in there. I guess we're going to have to. I didn't think it would come down to that. And for that matter... Oh, we, we, we mothballed you because you just weren't needed. Let's go for a while with six smiths and see if we can't get ahead of that curve yeah nails i haven't even looked at nails for the longest time right there nails are a thousand so it wouldn't hurt to get get ahead on nails as well okay six blacksmiths for a while we'll let you guys work through the winter and see if we can't uh, start getting these things caught up all right then so working on houses i keep in that tiny 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 little corner okay so you guys are going to get this one built and with so many carpenters or builders around we should be able to plow through that pretty quick and we're going to work on this one going to get the cart shed built get the other three houses in and then just to stall to put these guys in while we're waiting for these materials to arrive Maybe I need to push that a little bit further up and just keep moving it back, hoping that the that these guys eventually get around to doing this. You are just taking a trip through. Yeah. Okay. So now that you're in, maybe we can set into the building or two before we call this episode done. Um, I want the soapworks in soon, and I want the ash asheries going in. So we know we've got... A road through here I'm thinking 
these kind of buildings right in here and on the other side can be more of the glass works and pottery different shaped building use the road to kind of divide things up a bit so let's put in the soap and ash let's think about that ash i believe uses bark blacklia coming out of here and or a third uh, warehouse sitting right here full of bark is probably the plan once this one leaves so I can line them up better which means you probably sit in a place like this you probably do I'm thinking the soap works soap aligns with this guy now you popped out from underneath not the main road I wonder if that was a mistake uh, house and married. I put you get you in this area. Uh, line you with that right there. Something like that. A lot of room in between. Let's go more like that. Okay. Soap is there. The walk between to the asheries back here somewhere to get their supplies and tallow can be stored up in here too somewhere so we might have quite a few warehouses in here it's just a matter of lining them up better so they look good yeah so another warehouse there ash here and maybe back behind or maybe it's two rows of uh, maybe like six warehouses all stacked together big complex of, of storage that might be kind of interesting okay so you need to get you built soon so let's move you in yeah i have a feeling that the the subdivision out over here is is going to be a while before we're ready for that let's get some with you guys being labor for this area still then let's get some more jobs built right into here and and get some of these other things going that we that we were needing now can we sell soap? I don't remember actually coming across that in here. So, pork, in place of pork. Soap, we do. Okay, good. Alright, so leave that one there as a placeholder. So, it is something that we will be able to sell, and you are just out of carts now. You really are. So, let's check in on the blacksmiths before we call this one done. You are doing what now? There's some metal parts. I don't remember how many it takes to make a repair, but there's probably repairs needed in quite a few places. Uh, metal parts, there, that's horseshoes. Two. So you're probably grabbing them as fast as you can. Yeah. Reserved five, and you are... So must be five per cart. So you're working on carts right now. Okay. So that crisis is being diverted. Otherwise, are we done for this episode? Is there anything else that was really critical we've got these houses going in we've got the soap work set we're emptying these out how close are we 7600 uh 90 you're almost done and you are lime and you're filling up okay so you emptying storage but you are no you're doing it so one more load or do you have to go put the you're doing a 50 at a time by hand. Okay. So we'll wait just a little bit for you to make that last little trip. And then we'll set you to be deconstructed. Or you're going to go home. You went home. <laughs> okay, we'll catch that next time. So thanks for watching, folks, and talk to you later. Bye-bye.